It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one When you the only one that knows it Swante 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 Make a bill video for sinners Swante I so God sensei We need your opinion If anybody knows About what a good sinner should be It gotta be the, the greatest ISO God of our times I got y'all man I got y'all man I got y'all man What's good ass niggas It's the GOAT God in this You know King Swan So I got four Mother Builds For you Niggas, my nigga, I, I got y'all, bro. Um, th this isn't going to be knowledge that anyone else puts out there, cause I'm trying to find the exploit way. I'm trying to give you something that doesn't show what you got. Like, 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 for instance, you know how last year you could um, like, niggas were playing with lockdowns and no center, just a six seven lockdown, even on the twos or whatever, and they were destroying glass cleaner. That's what I'm trying to show you in this video, you know? I'm, I'm trying to find that, you know? Um, I didn't spend too much time looking at these builds because, you know, I'm an IQ sensei, my nigga. I know what to look for. You know, since there's no numbers, it's a lot harder to estimate, but keep in mind, I'm not a mother center. These are dominating positions that, that I think are going to dominate, okay? Um... Of course, there's other positions, but th this is what, because I'm, I'm not no do-nothing ass nigga. I'm not one of these niggas that's making these center builds just to hold their dick and get picked, carried by one of the top players in the game. You know, I'm, I'm not that guy. You feel me? <laughs> you know, that's not me, you know? So, um, yeah, post-scoring swan in the mother. Comment section. Y'all be sure to follow me on Twitch. Link in description. I'm gonna be streaming Destiny later. Come support a nigga, cause I'm that guy. Go sub to my nigga Steezo, and let's get into these, these bills, man. Now first, this nigga not even a sinner. <laughs> and this is all my opinion. If you don't like it, go f yourself, go make your own bill video, okay? Uh, suck me on soft, nigga. Like, what you talking about? Anyways, here's the first bill. 610, sharpshooter, okay? When you are 7-3 or you're in the center archetype, you can't get Hall of Fame, limitless range, Hall of Fame, deep range. And um, you get, um, we'll go over that later. But now, if, if this is what Mike has been saying, it's going to be like to where centers can't shoot threes, that stretch is going to be that guy. And if you make a 6-10 stretch, you get all the Hall of Fame badges, you know, he might be that guy. He might be that third wheel for an ISO nigga like me. You know, if, if if he really makes the game to where it's hard to shoot for everyone, especially centers and niggas have to start shooting middies and all that, these niggas are going to be way more valuable than you think. And and especially if um picks aren't as OP as last year and niggas just always greening and greening and greening and niggas not getting brick wall, these niggas for ISO is going to be really valuable, even on the pick and pop, my nigga, because all you got to do is disrupt the nigga. Trust me, I myself have set amazing screens. And, and I'm a guard with, with bronze brick wall and like no, no stats. So a 6'10, you know, he could pick a pop, roll to the corner, or he could be like delayed on the let me chill. I'm not giving y'all too much info, but you can use this nigga high key. So um that's 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 one of the builds. We gonna go to another one, my nigga. Y'all be sure to like the video and subscribe if you new, man. Support a nigga. And make sure you sub to my second channel. Here is the second position I want to show y'all. Now, th this might seem weird. <laughs> this might seem weird to y'all, but I'm definitely making a post score this year. Okay, guys? I'm making a post score. It is decided. And um, because I, I'm not no do nothing. You feel me? I'm a dominate niggas. I'm a kill niggas. Now, let me um tell y'all why... I, I I think this is going to be a pretty powerful position. And all, all these centers I'm talking about, this is in terms of playground. Um, Pro-Am, they might 
still be dominant, but I, I'm not too sure. Now, I don't know how high that mid range is, okay? I don't know if, if you really need a shot creator as your secondary skill to bring up the mid range. I don't know if it's cash. I don't know. I don't, I, I don't, this shit look like lower than 50 to me. I mean, I don't know. It's half the bars. So I don't know why niggas are saying it's like a 70 mid range. I don't know. So, um, yeah. Anyways, with this position, so you know, when you max out your height and your weight to be a big body center, you're extremely slow. So people aren't going to do that. They're going to make their nigga a little light in the weight or maybe a little, uh, like, less tall and you know to try and have some type of speed with this position from my incredible calculations my nigga sensei swan in the comment section you will be able to be 73 max weight and still have speed and be able to play deep you feel me and you'll be an offensive god and last year as i said before now this is some iq sensei shit you know you know I'm trying to give y'all something without having to be it. You can out rebound. Like you remember how I was telling you about the lockdowns, right? You're, you're half lockdown, right? So what if with this nigga, since his strength is going to be all super high and all that, you're able to out rebound glass cleaner positions while at the same time being bigger, stronger, and faster. And you can post cheese. Doesn't that sound miraculous? I mean, I think this is the, this has the highest potential. If I really found this nigga, you feel me? This nigga could be a god. Yeah. <laughs> High key. And um, I don't know what the post move stat is, but he sound like a god. Now, I heard some people talking about post three point. That That's not one of the builds I'm talking about. Because I don't know how high that three is. If he's able to cash from three then maybe he could be in the discussion. But I don't know. It, it still looked half the bars. What's that, a 50? I don't know, my nigga. Now I'm gonna show y'all another position. Here is the second position, my nigga. Now for some reason, there's also another build I might wanna talk about, but I don't really know. Uh, it, it Matter of fact, let me talk about this. I'm not talking about this build right here. I'm talking about a driving and driving. 7-3, okay? Matter of fact, let me show you. Let me show you something real quick. Look at this nigga. This is this is his stat being 7'3". So you can max the weight, the height, and he's still going to be faster than every other center. I think people later on in the year, they're going to start combining these driving and finishing niggas to their archetypes. Especially my nigga. Because this nigga, dog, look at his vertical, bro. You can max that jump, you know? And with vertical, bro, he just look like a dog, okay? That's not one of the positions I'm talking about. Let me um show y'all what I am talking about. Now, his post offense is still the same as the other position I showed you. As I was saying before, he's still going to be fast. So you might be able to bring his weight and his height all the way up on top of his vertical being high you make sure you max out his rebounding so he's not getting horsed and then you could still horse niggas because your vertical is higher than theirs i i think um like i haven't really looked at all the centers but for me looking at this archetype high vert he's still gonna be able he's gonna be able to do everything and then you're gonna be able to post cheese do those post drives those animation those blow buys you know when you hold l2 and then you hold and then you Hit the R2 and you try and blow past the nigga. Since you're stronger, bigger, and you got the athletic boost and you're a post scorer, that could be some cheese, my nigga. And then when you go for these dunks, I mean, you got you got the badges, bro. So I think that this, if I was a center, I would be this type of center. You feel me? You know, might might set a big body or or you know just go on the post and then just kill niggas, bro. And then if, if you could hit that mid-range, you know, you could you could do so much. But um, yeah, man. Y'all let me know what centers you think I brought up so far that are actually good. And what centers you're thinking about making, man. I'm trying to find y'all positions to where you don't have to be a glass cleaner. Um 
But yeah, because I, I don't like no do nothing. I don't like no nigga that can't hit no midi. You feel me? I see people making like rebounding shot creator, but I, I don't know what that midi is. I don't know if you're able to hit. So it's kind of hard to judge, but this is just my predictions of um some crazy, some, some crazy. Now, here's the fourth position of like some God shit, man. Some God shit. Okay. So this is all max out his weight, max out his height, max out everything. Big ass nigga. Big nigga, pause. Look, look at these stats, bro. Imagine, bro, a, a 7'3 speed demon slasher faster than any center that, that most people are gonna use from, from what I think, my nigga. And you can hit the mini. So you could do a lot of pick and pops and maybe he could still horse because his vertical is mad high. I don't know how this game's gonna be, but um, you know, they're, they're saying if you box a nigga out, you're going to get the board. So, who knows? You know, boxing niggas out is IQ, not position. But um, he looked like he could be a dog, my nigga. Then hit the midi. You know, what do y'all think? Y'all think these four, these are the four positions, my nigga. You got the 6'10", three-point slayer. Then you got the post-drive and finisher. Then you got the post-defender. Then you got the... uh. Slasher uh, shot creator, man. You know, there's a lot of other positions, but I think these will be some underrated demigod positions. I honestly, I would hate to be a center this year. And just to like try and figure out the weight, the height, the what what's actually going to work this year. And, you know, it, it, if the midi going to work, the three point, because you, you, could, you could really mess up a build. I'm glad I ain't no center ass nigga. But that is, um, you know, that's my take about it. Y'all let me know if y'all think any of these builds are going to be that guy. And um, I'm out this thing. Make sure you sub if you're new. And um, like the video, bro. I hope you niggas have a beautiful day. I think it's time for us to stir the pot. Like the feelings in the bits abroad. Because you heard a lot. And yes, I've been abroad. Because I work.